What's up guys, it's Jan Nagana coming at y'all with a brand new video. Today, as a former fat nigga, I will be making the best chips tier list. I know it's pretty random, huh? I was like, fuck it. I'm pretty hungry right now. That's all the thought that went into it. None, basically. Before we get into it, make sure you hit that like and subscribe button. Hit that notification bell to get all my newest uploads. Share the video with your friends. Comment, tell me what you think. And yeah, let's get right into it. Now, as a former fat nigga, this is the type of video I can make. You know, my opinion is definitely above others. Holy shit, boys. We got some chips here. Okay, this is so easy. Should I get the shitters out the way? You know where I'm gonna put the fucking Fritos, my nigga. Come on, my boy. Nobody eating no fucking Fritos. When there was always a box of chips, the party, the party box, bro, the Fritos are always gonna be the last one in there. Nine times out of 10, they won't never leave a box. You're gonna buy a whole new box and them Fritos from the old box still gonna be there. Fritos are dog ass, always have been. After the Fritos, I'm gonna go ahead and put the Sun Chips. Sun Chips are pretty bad, bro. There's different flavors for Sun Chips that's definitely better though. I'm gonna get into that though. But regular Sun Chips, hell ass. Okay, what's bad? Oh my God, this is gonna be crazy. Like I said, this is just me, bro. Takis are ass, they're not ass, they're bad. I don't know about Takis, bro. Hot Cheetos are definitely better. It's like Hot Cheetos, they have flavor to them. Like the Takis, I can taste the lemon in that shit. And after a while, my mouth is just on fire to the point I don't even taste anything anymore. I don't even like it. Takis are not that good. They're actually pretty ass to me. I'm not gonna put it in the ass because they're okay for like 10 seconds and they're just shitty. Yeah, I guess I could put the rest of these in here. Cause these Doritos are basically, they basically taste like Takis. We got the goddamn party mixes. Here's the thing about these party mixes. As a jit, mm, I'm a picky guy. So if I'm eating chips, I just want to eat chips. I don't like like how they include these little crackers and the pretzels and shit. So bro, I would literally just eat the Doritos or whatever, these nacho chips, and then I'll just eat the little Cheetos they had in here. So if you ask me, these are bad too. All right, let's look through the rest of here. There's gonna be a lot of shit in this mid tier. Mid is gonna be these, these, these flaming hot Cheetos. The ones that are way too hot. The, the, those ones are just hella spicy. Like spice is good for. I like spice, but like to the point where it's burning my mouth. It's crazy. This is also where I'm gonna put these other sun chips. These sun chips, like I ate them and I was like, wow, it has flavor. You know what I used to do as a kid? You're gonna be pissed. I would literally take a chip out the bag lick all the flavor off and then throw that shit away is that weird i don't know what some of these are what is this green dorito all right i guess i'll make a don't know category flaming hot lays like i've never had that shit before have y'all what the hell what am i missing out on only one two three four five and these got to be brand new which is why i haven't had them okay now we're gonna get on to the not bad gotta go with probably all these basic ass potato chips like i'll sit there and eat them sea salt and vinegar too it's like bro i can't eat them for a while but like i'm not gonna go out my way to get it even classic lays it's like bro they're just regular potato chips i can eat them but like there's not gonna be anything crazy this is where we get stupid good y'all are gonna learn some shit about me with these next next choose my bad these next choices the baked chips had less fat in them Shit, as a fat ass, I'm thinking, bro, if I eat these, I'm straight. Shit, I was eating them. They were good as hell. Shit, I was definitely still getting fat. So these were definitely in the A category. Regular Funyuns, A category. Shit, that shit bust. That shit just make your breath smell crazy, though. Okay, sleeper pick right here. I don't know if y'all know about these. You should find these at any local subway you go to. These jalapeno chips, the potato ones, my nigga, with this green bag, nigga, now. <laughs> All right, these actually bust. I could sit and eat them bitches for about two hours. In my heyday, I could, not now. I feel crazy. I don't even like eating them anymore like that. But when I was eating them, bro, I could eat them for hours. It was so, I could eat them for hours, bro. Like hours. What else can go in the A tier? Cheetos puffs. All the puffs can go in the A tier to me. I've always been a crunchy type of nigga. I've always been a crunchy guy. Nacho cheese can go in the A tier just because it's not my favorite flavor Dorito. And cheddar and sour cream lays can go in the A tier. So as you guys can see, wait, 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 one more. Sour cream ruffles too. Now we have, what do I always say in these videos? The cream of the crop. Look at the bottom of your screen right now. 
If any one of you sons of bitches disagree with me in the comment section, I'm gonna find out where you fucking live. Cause this is facts. I've been speaking straight facts. Every single one of these videos and one of you bitch ass niggas talking shit. Today, this is facts. Here we go. Starting off the S tier, we have the regular Cheetos. Boom. Can't go wrong with the regular Cheetos, man. The regular Cheetos is not gonna always be your first option, but if they're around, and you got them, you put one in your mouth and it's like, damn, that wasn't that bad. And you start eating another one and another one. And then you're just fucking cheese everywhere. Just next. Damn, I'm, I'm literally doing this on the fly. I don't know which one of these is my favorite. To be honest, bro, this list could change like in 10 minutes. Next, we're going to put spicy nacho Doritos. Boom. Here we go. Clap it up for spicy nacho. Spicy nacho is pretty good, man. Pretty good, all it's better than the nacho cheese. Uh, like I said, I like the little spice, but the thing about the spicy nacho is it's not too spicy, you know what I'm saying? Like, you get that little extra flavor and it's still enjoyable. Shit is delicious. What's next? What's next? I guess after that, we have to go with Cool Ranch Doritos. Clap it up for the Cool Ranch. Back in middle school, pay an extra dollar, you get one of these Cool Ranch Doritos, bro. If I didn't have one, I'd be looking at the nigga next to me like, bro, let me get a chip. You know niggas wasn't sharing, bro. We was just down bad. But my mom went to the store. She got a party size bag of these. Pour some of this shit on the plate. Shit. Bag might be gone in a few hours. Shit, I'm eight years old. On to the next chip. Okay, okay, I've got to go sour cream and onion lays. Okay, if there's a sour cream and onion chip, this is definitely the best version of it. Because the thing about lays is so, like, it's crunchy but it's easy to bite on it's like fragile even a little cream on the bag like shit shit made me want to bust that shit open right now after that i'm gonna have to put sour cream and cheddar ruffles on that shit. sour cream and cheddar and sour cream and onion damn near taste the same but one has cheddar yeah let me shut my mouth what's it called i just like the cheese better but the only thing about the cheese is okay here's the thing the cheese is better at first sour cream and cheese Sour cream and cheddar is better at first. I feel like if I had to eat a chip for three hours straight, I might be able to eat the sour cream and onion for the three hours. But the first hour, the ruffles is so much better than the first hour, the lays, and I'm gonna go with the ruffles. Bro. All right, I made my decision. I didn't even know these were a thing. And we're gonna go with the hot onions. I didn't know what hot onions were until quarantine. Quarantine is when I really started getting big. And my mom brought these in the house, bro. There was a party mix. But all the chips in there was spicy. And these hot funions was in there, bro. And when I tell you the difference between these and these is that big of a difference, I'm telling you it's a big ass difference. What they did to that shit, what kind of horse trank, I don't know what they, bro, that shit is delicious. You gotta just try that shit. Just try. Nigga, that shit bust, nigga. Swear to God. I know what these gonna be, bro. The fucking Doritos. The sweet chili Doritos. Sweet chili is, is exactly what it sounds like. The only thing about this is your breath gonna be hotter than a bitch. So you better have a bev and some toothpaste ready. Cause your shit gonna be kicking. But while you're eating that shit, it's shit. This is exactly what it say it is. It's hot, it's a little spicy, a little sweet. Motherfucker, that shit going down easy, boy. That's how good that shit is going down easy, boy. Fuck you know about that? The purple Doritos. Every day at lunch time, if this was if I got a chip, it would be this, nigga. I used to be at that lunch table with my hand on the bag, so no one could grab my shit, no one could stain my my chips. That's how serious it was. You had to put your hand on the bag and just hold that shit, so nobody would stain your food, bro. Number two, what should I put at number two? Should I go up? What's gonna get you through the day? Or what's gonna get you through this episode? We're gonna put some respect. Number two, we have to put Hot Cheetos. Hot Cheetos is number two. And here's why. Hot Cheetos is delicious, bro. But every time I eat Hot Cheetos, there's a lot of hazards that go into me eating Hot Cheetos, bro. My fingers turn red. My tongue is red. My lips are red. My mouth is on fire. And I have to take a shit. That's a lot of drawbacks right there. A lot of drawbacks. A lot of unnecessary drawbacks we shouldn't have to deal with. But all in all, better than Takis. The best kind of Cheeto. Crunchy, of course. And it's really not that hot. But after, like like I said, I'm eating a big ass bag. Eventually, that shit, I'm going to feel that shit. Hot Cheeto number two. Number one, I don't care where you're at. If you're eating it with a sandwich, barbecue lays. The best lay, the best chip ever.
ever created barbecue lace all my real niggas eat barbecue lace if you were born in the 2000s you like barbecue lace the only way you don't like barbecue lace is if you were born in 2015 and if you weren't born in 2015 and you like and you don't like barbecue lace what am i gonna say are you a mistake or what like barbecue lace is the best chip ever best chip i've ever eaten for now and that's all there is to it let's look at this list again it makes sense bullshit at the bottom heat at the top takis mid anything that tastes like takis mid party mix yeah i'm gonna just eat the cheetos and doritos in that bitch you can't talk shit to me about this it's my taste buds you gonna argue against that bitch you gonna argue against what my taste buds think i don't think so nigga yeah with that being said make sure you hit that like button make sure you hit that subscribe button we are grinding right now as always share the video with your friends let me know in the comment section down below what some of your favorite chips are without further ado i'm gonna get up on out of here man Peace. Every crime except rape. Into my savage like I'm out the egg. We call the body and still beat the case. Who can just let me dance with your best?